Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ellison Cruz, and welcome back to Pushmo World. We got ourselves some Nintendo murals here, and even though they're probably the exact same as we've seen across the last game, um, I'm still excited as hell to play this because Goombas is what? Oh my God! They're playing the they're playing the music, man. Oh, that is awesome. I think a couple episodes ago I was just blasting on how they're using the same theme, but no, this totally makes up for it. Oh wow, <laughs> that is ex that's awesome for us something as trivial as just a slightly different mix of a song we all know and love. That is awesome. <laughs> oh man, this song. Oh man, that is awesome. And they did nothing like this on the 3DS. I'm pretty sure. Oh my God, that is awesome. Uh, all right, let's let's probably need to push your dumb face back in, Mr. Goomba. Sorry, I'm sorry, good sir. Ugh, there we go. Did we just solve you? Yeah, we did. Oh, this is awesome. It's like a medley. Uh, did I mess up somewhere? I feel like I might have. I might have accidentally screwed something up here. That's not good. Yep, I totally did. I screwed something up pretty hardcore. Probably wasn't supposed to push everything back in, but that's okay because we can try again until all of our hearts are content. Actually. Hmm. Okay, maybe that's what we're supposed to do. <laughs> Alright, cool, and we just solved it pretty much. Hooray! Okay, I just need to get one of his stupid eyebrows out. His very angry eyes. Oh god, that is awesome! I love that. Oh, it's the happiest jig! Oh! Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> There, that was one happy ass jig for beating that Goomba. Oh my god. Ah, <laughs> oh, and then, ah. Oh. So I guess we get the same song, but still, that is, ah. Oh, I am a big fan. I don't know. I, I, I grew up with Nintendo Man, and so, I don't know. I was just, mm. It was Nintendo, PlayStation, then Xbox, which is weird, but I don't know. I mean, when you grow up with games like uh, Killer Instinct and Super Mario All-Stars, then you kind of have a skewed perspective on uh, games, I guess. I don't know. Killer Instinct was rare, wasn't it? Pretty sure it was. Yeah. Uh, this is exciting! So, welcome to still June 23rd on the sheer notion that, well, I really want to play some Nintendo murals, and they're playing the... Awesome music. Uh, well, we got ourselves a nice little underground theme. I've been doing a lot of Nintendo stuff lately, like Pushmo, Mario Kart 7, uh, Fortune Street, um, Killer 8. It's like I've been like the hella Nintendo fanboy lately, but let's not do that. Actually, we might have to do that. What the hell? Okay, hold on. We need to get to that red. Is this avoidable? Is this avoidable? Can we go through this without using that? I think we could, should we so desire. And actually, we can actually do this. There we go. I remembered this from the uh, last part, but we can actually sometimes do that. There we go. Very nice. <sighs> All right, so I think we just effectively solved it. As long as we don't screw anything up. There we go. Hooray! Oh, shoot. Oh, no, we're good. We are good, except I need to push that green back in. Nope, not that one. There we go. So I guess we did have to do it at some point. I didn't realize his eyes were also green. Uh, so let's go over here. Oh! Okay. I, they're, they're playing the water theme! Ah, this is probably one of my more favorite water themes in most video games. Like, I think I've told you guys about my prostensity for... I keep saying, like, prostensity, and I mean to say other things. Damn, I love this song. It's... Oh, and right here. Oh, and then the happy ass jig. Ah, oh, man. Man, I don't know what to tell you guys. I mean, uh, 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 uh. hope you guys can understand my sentiments, but we got ourselves a piranha ass plant here, and this looks familiar. Hmm. Oh God, that um, dem electrolytes, man. All right, let's see. We got ourselves. He's naked, apparently. I have a feeling we've done this one before. 
If someone would be so kind as to watch through every single one of my push mode customs and see whether or not we have, then please let me know because that would be very kind of you. And actually, I'm pretty sure we have done something along these lines, except there's a pullout or pushback switch on the right one. So let's go over here. Like, he's naked and he's fabulous and he knows it. He's not afraid to show the world his stripes. Okay, never mind. This one looks a lot easier than the other one. I remember, hmm, it feels like the 3DS had more content than this game. I think there's another page or another world that we can go to after this. Plus, we've also got the mystery push mode, so that's kind of cool. I don't know when to do those. I don't know. I, I feel like if this game is taking the same progression as the last one, that, uh-oh. Uh, purple is down here. I think. There you are. I feel like if this game has the same progression as the last one, uh, after we quote unquote beat the game, there's still gonna be a bunch of bonus stuff. So you don't really have to worry too much too much about that noise. Well, let's actually, hold on, I screwed up. I done dropped the ball, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna have to do something else a little differently. I'm gonna go do this so that we can do this. Actually, there we go. Oh, excuse me. And there we go. So today's Monday still, and uh, actually, tomorrow on Rocksmith DLC, which is something I still do, in case you guys are wondering. Um, oh nice, very convenient. They're releasing a surf pack with Miserlu and, uh, whatchamacallit, I can't even think of what it was called right now, uh, Wipeout, and then, um, Don't Walk Stop, or whatever that song is about adventures. I'm like, oh baby, that's awesome. And so with that, with that happy as triumphant, happy as jig, then uh, we've got ourselves a nice little cheap cheap here. Very nice. So I'm excited about that, um, but I have to work, <laughs> so I won't be able to get to them as early as I would like to. But you know, it doesn't not terribly. I mean, at least it won't be super early where I'm afraid to wake people up. It'll be at the point where you know people should be up, and it's not even a common courtesy to play. So. I'm excited, plus they're not going to be that difficult since me and my brother, we like to do the jamsy jams to uh, Dick Dale and uh, the safaris every now and then, so that's kind of fun. And uh, yeah, I'm excited. I love Mr. Lou. Uh, it's going to be Tremolo City, I'll tell you guys what. Alright, so push back. I don't know if we want that. Alright, pull out your spectacles, good sir. I still haven't gotten my glasses yet. I've been kind of anxious to see what they really feel like because I think I was telling you guys, I don't think I actually told on camera, but I went to the eye doctors a couple weeks ago and they had this lady who's who's literally her only job, whoops, that didn't work. Literally her only job is to like kind of, I don't know, I don't want to say assess, but just like see what fits with your face. And so she was giving me a bunch of like different glasses and she was like being like super critical, not like in a rude sense or anything. She was just like, oh, you know, I think what, what would look really good on you because you look really artsy and interesting. I'm not even kidding you. She called me artsy and interesting based on almost nothing. And that's not really a good thing. Um, actually this works well. And so, I don't know if I should have taken that as a compliment, but I felt rather, uh, let's try this actually. I felt rather flattered at that, so, I don't know. And so the glasses we picked were pretty expensive, I don't know if that was her, I, her plan, but... Actually, hold on, we just solved it. We can just use those, those redness there. Ugh, if I'd stop missing simple jumps. Oh, let's see. Oh, oh, there we go. And do we get the water theme? Yes, we do. Right at the end of the cheap, cheap. Damn it. Oh my god, I love it. It's like, it's so calming. It's like a carnival. So, yeah, it was weird because at first she would give me a bunch of those stupid hipster glasses and she's like, yeah, sometimes people just come in just for, you know, generic lens and frames. They would spend like $300 on getting those stupid hipster glasses. And she gave me a couple of those, but they were like the legit, like, not plastic kind, if you will. And so, I was like, eh, that's not really my style. I don't really want to <laughs> come off as that way. Do I seem like if I wore glasses, that would be what I would wear? Just like a little bit. So we went with more of a, more of a rectangular kind of thicker, not super thick, but I don't know. I think they probably fit pretty well on me. I was hoping for something a little bit bigger though, because I need to not use my contacts so frequently. Which is the main reason why I went to the uh, to the eye doctors, so I can get an actual pair of eyeglasses. And I kind of screwed up. Actually, I think we're good. Hold on, let's try this. Ah, it's such a Nintendo ass remix of this song, you know? I don't know. All right, did we just solve it? Maybe we might have just solved it. That's like the most frequently asked question on these videos: is did we solve it? <laughs> I feel like we might have, but at this point. 
Uh, the jury's still out on that one. Damn it. The thing I hate about Gatorades is that I always feel like I'm gonna knock them over. And if I do, it's because I usually do have the cap on. We got ourselves a spiny or spinny. I don't know, how do you pronounce it? I always call them spinies. But then I heard some pretty prolific, prolific? I was gonna say proficient, and then I was gonna say prolific. Some pretty prolific people saying, uh, spinnies, which would make sense because they spin, but wouldn't, I feel like spinny would be S-P-I-N-N-Y, and spiny would be S-P-I-N-E-Y, which means that this is, this, uh, spelling is at quite an impasse here, if I do say so myself. So let's get this. God, this, these Nintendo levels are awesome, I don't know. I was thinking, oh my god, this is spoilers. If you guys are up to date on what I'm uploading on my channel, I was actually seriously contending on starting Super Mario Sunshine for the beginning of summer. Or not really, because the beginning of summer was a couple days ago, but... I was thinking about starting uploads on the 1st of July of just daily Super Mario Sunshines and then 100%ing it, just so I can say I did, because at this point... Anybody who is LPing that game either has never LPed a game in their life or um, they just need to get it out of the way because it's like, it's like graduation almost. It's like you haven't graduated college until you've taken, you know, class 404 on sexual education or something. I don't know. That feels like something they should be teaching at school and I can't make that. Hmm. All right, Mr. Spinny, how dare you? How dare you make me look stupid in front of all these people here? All six people who are watching. Actually, let's try this. Let's try something a little bit different, eh? Let's do this. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, very nice. Except that didn't help at all. Um... Well, what is there left to do here? How do we even pull those out? Oh, okay, that works. I just noticed that out of the corner of my eye. I was like, wait a minute, that's totally a switch there. It was uh, the water medley. Ah, God. I just love it, I love it. Oh, I'm the happy ass jig for the ages. God, I don't know what to say about that. I have to blow my nose. That's really gross. I'm sorry. But every time I start commentating, I just always have to get to that level where. I just start having a congestion of, uh, I guess, it's not really even phlegm in my nose, it's just like, hey, I'm gonna be a prick to you today. You wanna try and talk for a long period of time? Well, you can't do it without sounding gross and disgusting, so <laughs> just stop it. Don't even think about it. It's a sign. It's people telling me, hey, you need to stop making LPs. You've been doing it for like five years and you only got like five consistent viewers. I think it's time to take a break. I was like, dude, screw you. I'll do what I want. Now, let's pull this one out all the way. I feel like that might help. I mean, actually, hold on. This weird amber brown piece. Uh, I feel like we need to get on that red that's over there. So I'm gonna push you back in for a little. There we go. All right. Yeah. Um. I actually was playing this like last couple episodes on the gamepad, and now I'm using the TV because I took a little break and I was like, eh, I'll look at the TV for a little bit. And um. Hold on, let's see. Do we need to pull everything back in? We might. We might. I might need to play around with that. But the colors are much more vibrant on my television than they are on the gamepad, so I think that's that has that going for it. So, okay, so the red is over there. That's what I'm going for, and can't make it. It was worth a try. I, I kind of figured they would just put it out of reach. Is the baby yelling mama every single time? It's weird. Alright, hold on, let's see. Um... Let's pull this out. I don't think that... Holy crap. Oh, hold on. I think I'm gonna screw it up. We can't get back up any if we tried jumping off there. Let's do this. Um... Well, shoot. Does that work? Is that good for us? That's not, because... Uh... I don't know what to do here. Alright, let's try this. Okay. That might be what I wanted to do. Now we just avoid the... Hey! Awesome music again! Uh... So yeah, Super Mario Sunshine, just to get it out of the way, you know how it goes. You're not a true LPer until you've LPed the shite out of Super Mario Sunshine. So also it'd be really easy, like, I don't know, it's just the, mm, the game feel in Sunshine is, it's fantastic. And the song is not helping matters whatsoever. Doesn't think it copyrighted to Helen back. Uh, excuse me. Alright, let's try this. Oh, nice. It does it again. That's awesome. 
All right, let's try something a little bit different. I'm clearly doing a horrible job at this. Actually, hold on. The blue is out. The blue is free. Okay, okay, now we just need to go back over on the red. Okay, good, 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 good. And we just drop down on over to the blue here, and we just solved it perfectly. Oh, an awesome new theme. Ah. Uh. It, it had totally had that octopus's garden like reverby thing going on for it there. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's a, a BGM mode in this game, so I, maybe if we unlock it at some point, we'll be able to listen to it in its entirety. But we got ourselves Bullet Bill here, Mr. Bullet Will, I should say. Uh, God, now my legs falling asleep. Nice little techno retro ass sound effects there. Uh, Alright, let's see. Pull this out. And what do we got in here? Inside a manhole number one. Yeah, after this I'm probably gonna go go take a nice little uh, nappy nap or something. I don't know why I have to do that so much. I just like stupid like. I noticed in Killer 8 there was an episode where I said bloodsy bloods like six times. I was like, are you kidding me? What are you on, Elson? This is unacceptable. Okay, so we need to get to that. But we can actually make that. But we need to pull it out more than one, is the problem. Yeah, and this leads us way the hell over here. Okay, I have a feeling. Uh, hold on. Let's try something a little different here. Alright, so we need to pull this black one out. Okay, I think I got it. I got it. I got it. We go in this red one, and then we can just go into the blue ones again. And then we actually have more space up here this time. Very nice. Very clever, Nintendo. I appreciate it quite a bit. Okay, let's do this. Uh, ugh, there we go. That was a little harder to jump up than I thought it would be. Don't need that, but there we go. Did we just solve it? I think we did. I think we did. Lucky us. Very nice. I'm really glad they changed the music. I'm still... And they even put a new happy ass jig. I was... I was gonna start listening to some music in this episode. Just like... Just like off ambiently in the back. Kind of like in Killer 8, but in this... It's like no need, and hey, we have Bowser! Bowser, eh? Mario? Whatever. God, this one looks irritating already. Just ones with like, one color going in like an angle like his shell is. That's always really annoying. Uh, this might take a little bit of... This looks familiar, I feel like they reused this. I'm pretty sure most of these are pretty identical to the how they were in the past. Except they probably just have different placements of manholes and the such. So that's not too bad. Alright, so and this isn't this is number 99, so we've almost reached our 100th pushmore, ladies and gentlemen. How do you how does, how does that make you fine folks feel? Okay, let's try pulling this one out. This would be good. We're locking ourselves in this way, but that's fine by me because, well, it gives us a chance to solve these awesome ass pushmores. And actually, that this might not be the greatest idea. Yeah, because we, we can't even get back up, can we? Except we have here. <laughs> okay, this is perfect. So, uh, I really wish you could have like different options for your gamepad because there are times like this where I really just want to be able to glance down and be able to see what you guys are seeing in the bottom right hand corner. Because right now they're all the same and maybe I should experiment a little with that, but I don't know. I'm pretty sure you cannot. Because Nintendo just has this way of not letting you change controls if you don't feel like it. Like, we were playing Mario Kart 8 and apparently you can't switch your your controller scheme in any variety whatsoever, aside from tilt or control stick controls. So, that's kind of weird. And I feel like we might have reached an impasse here. Hold on, let's see. Uh, this does not help in any variety. Damn it. Um, let's see. Let's try this one more time. I'm hoping I didn't screw anything up. Uh, awesome music. All right, all right. Here we're doing something different. We're doing, we're doing it. We're doing it. Uh, uh. All right, and we can. Well, this won't even do anything because we can't even reach it. We can't do nothing here. Okay. I'm... All right, all right, all right. One more time. One more time. We're doing it. We're doing it, ladies and gentlemen. We are solving it. Sorry, I'm, I know there's probably more, less convoluted ways of doing this, but... Alright, I'm gonna do something a little different here. Can I do this? Ugh! Wow! I don't think I'm supposed to be able to make that. But that's okay, we're, we're pulling out your hands, man. Hold my hands with your, uh, skin-ass colored hands. Right, skin-ass. Uh. Alright, so I think we're good, actually. There's blue right there. Huh. 
one. I don't think, do we, hmm. Uh, sorry, I'm kind of listening at the music now. <laughs> Okay, this actually works very nicely in our favor. This is what I was hoping to do the last time. But we need to get that yellow. Huh. So I guess everything we did down there was kind of pointless, wasn't it? Oh, and it just loops. Darn it. I should have continued a little bit. Oh, wow. I think we just pretty much just made it. Hopefully, uh... Let's... Yeah, wow. Okay. Well, I guess we just kind of stumbled on that by accident, but hopefully we can actually sell these. Okay, let's do this. Uh, 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 push you back in. Yeah, I remember that one. That The ones on the sides always seem to elude at times. Alright, and I do believe we just solved it. Well, kind of. There we go. Alright, fantastic! Ladies and gentlemen, we just beat Bowser. Oh, man. Hooray! Next Pushmo, and for the last one, hopefully this uh, recording hasn't been too long. Oh, we've got Peach! Oh, it's a progression! We go from Goomba to Koopa Troopa to the Cheap Cheeps to the Lactus and then Bowser and then Peach. And she's given us finger guns. Bang, bang, Tobey Maguire finger guns for days and days and days. Yeah, she's like, hey, you are awesome. So I'm not really because I'm a lame -o. Yeah, I don't know what it is about <laughs> these... 8-bit creations seeming like they have uh, weird finger expressions, but more power to them. Alright, so let's go pull off your dress, Peachy. Give you a nice little haircut. Um, <laughs> okay, let's let's try something like this. Let's, let's, mm, damn it. Uh, hopefully they change the themes for levels that aren't, you know, like Nintendo themed. Like, at least we get something else, because this this definitely sounds like it belongs in a Pushmo game. But, just like, other songs would be really nice. Like, I think there was only, like, five unique songs in the last one, and actually, hold the phone here. For just five seconds, good sir. I need that white block out. If that would be at all possible, I would appreciate it. The ocean says you should do what I say. Okay, that might actually work well in our favor. There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Exactly what I want to do. And green is open to me. I am quite pleased with this. We'll give you a nice little haircut there, Miss Peach. Give me a nice little uh, pixie cut there. And we can't make it. Uh, can we? We can make that jump, but I just sucked it at it. All right. We need to pull this out. So we need to get yellow, but we need to pull out her face a little bit. Okay. So let's do that. Now the yellow. It's right over here. Okay. We just solved it. Perfect. All right. I'm glad for that. Hooray! Ladies and gentlemen, we just finished the Nintendo murals! <laughs> oh, that's so depressing. <laughs> okay, sorry, I had to blow my nose there. That sounded really gross, so I probably cut it out, but... And so there we have it! Nintendo murals are all finished! <laughs> Hooray! So we have, up to this point, 100 Nintendo murals, which are, Nint are just... Pushmo solved, 100 children rescued. It's like, Jesus Christ, there was quite the baby boom. You guys have to, it kind of makes you wonder, like, what the economy is like in Pushmo land, in Push Blocks world or whatever. But next time on uh, Pushmo world, we're gonna go ahead and take on some special challenges, which I hope are special. And I'm gonna go check if I can send out a message, because I completely forgot to right there. So let's see, can I send Miiverse things here? I was gonna say something kind of awesome, but. Let's see if I can even do it. Uh, nope, apparently not. Damn it. So I can only do Miiverse posts if I'm at the end of a level. Damn it, I was gonna say something like, Hooray Nintendo, or something. I would probably have to put spoilers on it, even though it completely goes without saying. So next time we'll take on some special challenges, probably not until tomorrow or something, I don't know, but it will be a new day, all right? Hope to see you guys there.